guys, it's Ashley from Not A True Reviews and today we are unboxing the Sudsley box. This is a monthly all natural, vegan, cruelty free, all that stuff, bath and body subscription. I do love this box. They have a few different options, so I'm going to try to get this right. There's a beginner's bliss box, um, that's $18.50. There is a just soap box and that is $19, I think $99. There's also just a bath bomb box, same price, $19.99. And then there's a spa box that's $32. So that's like their deluxe box. Um, I do not know which one this is. Um, as we open it, we're going to figure it out. It's I'm guessing, um, just to show you guys a variety, it's either the Beginner's Bliss or the Spa Box. So um, I can smell it already. Uh, so that's always promising. I love, you guys know I love bath bombs. I used one this morning. Yes, I got up and I was like, I dropped the kids off at the school bus. I'm like, I got so much to do. I think I need a hot bath. Sounds about right, right? All right, so here it is. I love this, like, they have this foil sticker. It's so pretty. Um, because you're worth it, naturally. At Sudsley, we know that the way a product leaves your skin feeling is just as important as where the ingredients come from in the first place. I'm sorry, I think I have something in my teeth. <laughs> it's the little changes to your everyday lifestyle that make all the difference. And it's our belief that you, I smell citrus, you deserve only the best. The luxurious self-care box you've been dreaming of. Our most popular subscription box, 100% all natural, with two bath soaps, two bath bombs, plus additional organic bath body and skincare items, naturally. The only way to pamper yourself. <clears throat> Discover your box. So then they do list all the items over here. Uh, this is the luxury all natural spa box. So this would be $32. It does say it right here. All right, let's pop in here, babies. There is lots of crinklers. Where am I gonna put these? So I don't, I always just throw them on my floor, which is like, it's a devil's trick. All right, <clears throat> today's Satan. All right, <laughs> sorry, it's so weird. All right, so here's everything that we received. You can see where there's two bombs, two bars, and then some product over here. And um, it looks like there's something down here too. All right, so we're just gonna go through it, right? Ooh, this is something. What is this? A mask? Ooh. Activated charcoal and black cherry mask. This is from Natural Fundamentals. So it has little instructions there. <coughs> oh my gosh, my chest. I think I have bronchitis, guys. It's just the truth. Um, so I hope I'm not going to have a coughing spell. It's about to happen, I think. I can feel the tickling in my throat. Hold on. Oh my gosh. Ooh, Okay. So you mix this guy with water, you put it all over your face. I've never used cherry in one of these masks though, so I'm super pumped for that. Ah, I hate looking at my hands, like look at the cat. I have all these calluses from working out, like lifting weights. It hurts, it hurts a lot. I was even um, saying the other day that it would be really cool. I know I'm, on, I'm off, you know, never talking about what I'm supposed to be talking about. It would be really cool if the stuff for your feet, baby feet, you could put it on your hands. And then I was thinking about that, like walking around in public with your hands peeling off and that would be pretty gross. But I mean, it would also be kind of cool too, just saying. All right, so moving right along, not wasting your time with this stuff I think about. I think about weird stuff sometimes. Um, this is from, I can't see the name here. Genevieve and Theodella. I'll look at the card then, we'll look together. Uh, Ride With Me, Peppermint and Pine 5.5 Classic Size Bath Bomb. And you can see they have like little pine in here. I can't really smell it. I am not a huge pine person, so I will probably pass this off to my daughters though. Um, it's just uh, one of those, when it's a fragrance oil or essential oil, it gives me a headache. People love it. It's cool if you love it. And I love that it's out there. It's available. It is festive. It's just one that I can't use personally. Let's go to the second bath bomb because it looks bigger. Um, cranberry fur bath bomb. This is from Nature As It Comes. I love that they source it. Look at how big this one is. This is like a six ounce, 10 ounce, I don't know. Oh, they have all their ingredients listed right there. There's like six. Uh, cranberry fur sounds fantastic. And it has like a pink and gray appearance. I don't know if that's gonna pick up on camera, but it's really cool. I think this is what I'm smelling. It's like a citrusy, cinnamon. It might be this other stuff though. All right. So right here we have Love It First Bite Sudsley Soap. This is from Sudsley, I'm supposing then. 
Ooh, this is what I'm smelling. It's like a cinnamon. Uh, let's see if they have the clove and a natto. And then look at the top. It's real cool. This is great to have in your bathroom, like right around this time of year. Um, for in, for like guests to just enjoy the festive sense of the season. Loving it. All right, next we have orange pico and spice. This is also from Sudsley. Orange pico. Is that like tea? Or is it like a herb? I don't know what pico is, but it has a very bright, like blood orange, like that very bright, like the bite of orange. It smells really good. This is really like a first thing in the morning kind of soap where like you want to be invigorated. Um, really, really nice. This is a shower soap, I would say. For me, I always like to define the smell, like what I would do with that soap. Sorry, I'm tea. Um, I like to define what I would do with that soap. Like if I feel like it's ornamental, like you never use it ever, you just put it somewhere to display. Or if you use it for your guest bathroom, or if you use it in your own shower, things like that. All right, so our final item in here. This is Dragon's Blood Sugar Scrub from, this is also from Sudsley. I'm actually gonna open this here because I'm curious. They did, ta it is taped so it doesn't leak. Um, I want to see what Dragon's Blood Sugar Scrub looks like. Um, what is Dragon's Blood? Use once a week for glowing skin. Always test first for allergies. There's rosemary in here. Huh. Sweet almond. What is Dragon's Blood? I don't know. Patchouli, orange, cedar wood. Ooh, a proprietary essential oil recipe. Maybe I'm not supposed to know. Stop digging around, Ashley. <laughs> Just kidding. All right, so here's a little, I should show you the jar too. This is like what, a two ounce, three ounce, four ounce, I don't know. We're going to guess. All right, everything's sealed. It's nice. Ooh, I thought it would be red. Did you think I was like, oh, it's not red. I'm like, that's going to make my water red. It's going to be really confusing. It smells really good. It's mild. It actually, I thought I'd smell more more patchouli, but it's mostly like a little, it's like mildly orange. And then that cedar wood at the end is really, really nice. This is relaxing. This is like when you're soaking in the bath. All right, so let's look at our card. So we got the sugar scrub, the two soaps, the two bath bombs, and the mask, which I actually need to do a mask. So maybe I'll try another one. Never know. All right. Let's look at our little card here. Orange Pico and Spice Soap made with three essential oils and cinnamon. The orange essential oil is relaxing while the Mei Chang essential oil, I've never even heard of that, which stuff sounds really cool. Essential oil is refreshing and uplifting and excellent for all types of skin issues like eczema and psoriasis. I might pass this on to my daughter who has eczema really bad. Uh, not really bad. She has moderate eczema, but she complains about it a lot. The cinnamon essential oil is all natural and anti-inflammatory and antibacterial, which is great. All right, cranberry fur, nine ounce. That's a nine ounce bath. That's a huge bath bomb, by the way. From nature as it comes. Drop, just drop this in water for an amazing aroma. This bomb has cinnamon essential oil, fur essential oil, and orange essential oil. It has an extremely high essential oil ratio, so you can break it in half and still get full benefits or indulge yourself and use it all made to relax and rejuvenate your skin. So that's one that I would honestly, I will break it in half because I don't spend that. When I get a hot bath, like people are like, you, that was really quick. I get in, like, I'm like, okay, I just sat in here for like 10 minutes. I think honestly, my body's like, I want magnesium because um, magnesium is good for your muscles. It's also good for your like system. Like uh, it elevates all the levels. I don't even know if I'm saying this right, but I think magnesium is like the magic thing for me. I like to get a hot bath, but it's never a long one. So half is enough for me of probably all bath bombs, to be honest. And now I'm rambling. Ah! All right. So <laughs> love it. First bite soap. This is an intoxicating mix of natural spices, herbs with pumpkin beer, cinnamon and cloves. How cool is that pumpkin beer? Um, once you use this soap, you will fall in love. The certified natural fragrance is a trade secret. And once this one is gone, it won't come back for one year. This soap is full of essential oils to soothe your skin and awaken you for the day ahead. Go ahead, take a bite out of life. Ooh, was I wrong about that soap? Should I be using it first thing in the morning? I just feel so festive to me. You know, like it felt really festive. 
Oh, peppermint and pine, 5.5 ounce bath. This is a bath bomb that soothes your skin and awakens your mind. The peppermint essential oil is beneficial to the entire body for mental acuity, according to the University of Cincinnati study. Ooh. And helps with an abundance of skin issues. It should not be used around your eye. <laughs> Don't put the bath bomb around your eyes. Um, the sea salt helps your skin retain moisture. Dragon's Blood Sugar Scrub. Use this once a week for glowing skin. This has nine essential oils to help you relax, renew, energize, and awaken, and four oils to moisturize and soften. Mm. Use sparingly as a little goes a long way. Then there is the Activated Charcoal and Black Cherry Mask um, by Natural Fundamentals. And this tells a little bit. It says, we found Jessica and her amazing face masks and we're blown away. She uses only the best natural ingredients, and this one is full of Activated Charcoal, Rose Clay, which is amazing. Um, you guys know how I feel about rose. It's got a lot of good things about it. Four essential oils and black cherry powder. Each ingredient has a specific purpose in drawing out toxins and renewing your skin. Mix with a half a teaspoon of water. Use a medium paste pest, paste la, 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 until a medium paste forms, adding drops of water until it's spreadable over your entire face. Leave on for 30 minutes until fully dry. Rinse off thoroughly. Allow your face to breathe for an additional 30 minutes. This box value is over $50. So for your $32, you are getting 50. And that's like $18 above what you pay. Um, I do really love this box. What do you guys think? Are you guys into bath bombs? Are you into bath stuff? Do you take hot baths? Um, and all that stuff. Do you love like the essential oils? Like, do you like to learn about new essential oils? When I hear about something new, like the orange pico and the pumpkin beer, I'm like, Ooh, what are those ingredients? Those aren't things that you see very common. And it gets exciting for me. I love new. I love to experience stuff um so let me know down below what you think of this box i will link down below to sudsley i will also link to my full review where i will go in depth maybe we'll do a demo i haven't done a bath bomb demo in 100 million years anyway thank you guys so 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 much for watching i'll see you next time